Hi, this is Jonathan Wilson from GrooveWindow.com. This is Groove Starter number one, open fifths, and this is part four out of four. This piece is structured with an ABA arrangement, and this is the last A and the ending. I'm going to start by playing it pretty slowly. Okay, the good news is the last section here is almost exactly like the first section. This piece is written with an A, B, A structure. The only tricky part is it's, if, if this were a video game, this is a little harder level. <laughs> we, we, we do the same kind of open fifths with a chord and bell tones, but it's all almost double speed is what it was. If we think about the way this got played in the first time, it was... This time, those bell tones come much quicker and the whole thing is much faster. So it's, it's exactly the same notes. There's nothing different in the notes, it's just the bell tones come faster. So you've got no new notes to learn here. All you've got to do is figure out how to move your hands quickly. Your sustain pedal is going to come in very handy. The trick with all these things is to play the note, put your sustain pedal down, and immediately move your hand into position to get the bell tone. Because when this comes quickly, Got to be able to find those notes very fast, okay? And the way I always do this is absolutely memorize it. Just work on this much. Do it again. And you can just skip to the next part. Take those two and put them together. Good. And keep adding until you've got the whole thing. And now the only thing we've got to look at next is the very ending, which is exactly the same as the beginning. So we ended up with this. That's the end. I mean, I really, I don't even have to show you these notes because they're exactly identical to the first notes in the piece. Go back to clip two where we walked, talked about those, and those are the notes. So with that, you've got the whole piece. This is, you're going to have to practice moving your hand quickly. But you've got enough here to get through the whole thing. Let's hear that last section at full speed. Okay, remember that you can get the sheet music and MIDI files for this over at GrooveWindow.com. That's the last section. You should have enough to put this one together. I hope to do many more of these groove starters to kind of get you going in the right direction, each one covering a different technique. But I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly did.
and I hope you come back for the next one.